Nikki Bernstein here with trainer David Casson, who will send out Nikki Sandcastle this Saturday in the Grade 2 McDermott Stakes. His last race here on January 12th ran in the Grade 2 Fort Lauderdale Stakes, ran a really close fourth. He's a really consistent horse. He went into that race as the favorite. Can you walk us through that race a little bit? Well, he was way back again. Don't have to be, but he was. And when Corey decided to move on him, he elected to come around, and them horses just kept bunching up. And the next thing you know, he's about 10 wide. And uh, the horse he had passed around the turn, they passed him back up the time he straightened away in the stretch. And then he made a pretty good run down there. It looked like he could still win at the eighth pole, but he just hung, you know, and it was just too much to overcome. In his last few starts, he ran a little close together with only around three weeks in between. This race, he's had a little more time off. What do you think about the added time uh, going into this race? Well, we just can't dance every dance, you know, and we had to give him a little break in between. We skipped a race, and he's coming into this race real well. He worked good the other day, and uh, the question is if we can get him out on three-eighths. I think we can, you know, and uh, we'll see what happens. I was just going to ask you, this is his first time going this distance, a mile and three-eighths. He is a consistent and versatile horse, so you think the added distance shouldn't be a, too big of a problem? I don't think so. You know, there's some pretty fast horse in there, some speed, but that doesn't really affect him too much. He's pretty versatile. He can lay up close or he can come from off of just depending on what the pace dictates. So we'll just play it by ear. And you mentioned his uh, bullet work on February 10th going five furlongs. Were you pleased with that work? He went pretty easy. Corey worked him and liked the way he went. He went 59-2, and two, and uh, he did it pretty easy, you know, so he's coming into the race in good shape. And being an older horse at six years old, how do you think his style has changed in his older years? Well, you know, when I first got him, he was a little rank early, you know, wanting to show more speed, but he's kind of settled in now, and he's pretty rateable, you know, and you can kind of do what you want to with him. Well, we look forward to seeing Nikki Sandcastle this Saturday, the Grade 2 McDermott.